I feel like it helps me pay attention to Mass if I actually can participate in it more. Okay. And it helps me to like focus on what God's telling me. Okay. If I can see everyone else kind of, instead of like having my back to people. Or, well, there was a time when a candle fell on the ground. <laughs> I was trying to light it because the, there was a new priest and he had told me to use this other thing to light it that I wasn't used to. And so it lit something on fire. <laughs> <laughs> Did you, the, the, church, the church didn't burn though? No, no. I stomped it out. Okay. And then there was a time when my friend on Ash Wednesday, the ashes spilled and they tried to clean them up and it didn't work. <laughs> Because we had carpeted floor. That was pretty bad. Have you all four served at the same time? Yes. Now? And what was that like for your parents? Well, they were sitting alone, which is probably nice for them for once. And they like watching us up on the altar, especially when they can see like one of us is confused and the other one's like, go that way. I was surprised, honestly, because I know so many altar servers who are like better at it than I am, or I would think so. But I was, I was proud. Yeah, one time, I showed up late and I was like really young, it was my first year and I didn't know what to do. So I was just kind of sitting there uh, and the mass had already started my parents were like, you gotta go serve. And so I had to run around to the back and kind of walk onto the altar like uh, be like really chill about it. It's definitely helped grow in my faith because um, before I'd sit in mass and I wasn't really aware of what was going on. and sort of not in touch, but after starting to alter serve, it definitely helped me. I was surprised. I was not expecting it, but it's definitely a welcome surprise. When I wasn't serving, I would pay much less attention to the mass, but because I'm a servant, I can also pay attention to the liturgy of the word. Going to mass is the same, no matter if you're serving or not, you still hear the same liturgy, but being serving the other people in the mass means you get to actually I mean, it's vital, to, and I think it's very important, especially in encouraging young people who serve in ministry in the church, to recognize that we see what they do, the ways in which they, they sacrifice of themselves to, to be present at all these masses and to, to assist leading people in worship. And that's something that for the Archbishop and for us in the vocations office, and I think all priests would always want to encourage, recognize, and, and draw attention to that. Not so much as like putting people on pedestals, but rather to say, look, this is really a, a va valued and vital ministry in the church that we, we always want to throw those kids in. What kind of impression do you think this might have on some young men and women? It's a special moment anytime when we recognize that others recognize something special in us, right? Very often we can call ourselves into question or in doubt, or even especially in ministry, you know, is what I do really recognized? Is it really needed? Is it really vital? Is it very important? And I think this is a moment, this, this opportunity to give out these awards, is a moment to say, yeah, we see you, we recognize you, and we appreciate the ministry you have. And I think that's important for those, those, those young people to know that, that they're seen, they're recognized, and they're, they're very much appreciated. I, I, uh, I also served as a child, and, um, and I, I think it was, there was something neat about being so close to where the action's happening, so to speak, that you're able to, in a very particular be close to everything that's going on, uh, in the Mass, in the prayers, in the liturgy, in all those different symbols and things that are happening that, that starts to really sink in and have an effect on you. So, yeah, I couldn't underline the importance anymore that that, that, that I could have had in, in, in fostering my own vocation.